In the video on likelihood, I talked about what likelihood is and gave some examples. However, normally when we are calculating likelihood, we want to know the joint likelihood that the model has some parameters given a set of data points. Typically, we assume that each point is independent and identically distributed, meaning that where each point is doesn't depend on where the other points are, and that one model describes where each point is. Since each data point is independent, that means the probability of every point is equal to the product of the probabilities at each point. Similarly, the likelihood of all points is equal to the product of the likelihood at every point. Log likelihood is just the log of the likelihood. We use the log so that our function has two nice properties. Products turn into sums and exponents turn into products. So if you take the log of the likelihood of multiple data points, you will get a formula that looks like this, where we are summing over the log of the likelihood instead of multiplying the products. With a lot of data points, multiplying probabilities together will quickly approach zero and underflow, meaning that the number gets so small we can no longer represent it properly. How are we maintaining the meaning of likelihood if the metrics are based on log likelihood? After all, likelihood is the function we care about. Well, it turns out that whenever we use likelihood, we usually compare the likelihood of one model with the likelihood of another model. So all we really care about is whether the likelihood of one model is greater than the likelihood of the other. By observing that log is a monotonically increasing function, that is, it never decreases, we can notice that if we take the logarithm of both sides, the greater than sign stays the same. If we plot a graph of likelihood versus log likelihood, we can see that as the likelihood increases, the log likelihood will always increase as well. Therefore, we can see that any time we are comparing two likelihoods to see which is greater, we can instead compute the log likelihoods to see which is greater. 